Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, June 24, 1799, Thomas Jefferson wrote his first letter to William Dunbar. Born in Scotland, William Dunbar has come to America in 1771 and by 1784 had established a plantation near Natchez where he cultivated indigo and cotton. Dunbar was known for his engineering and scientific talents. He invented a screw press for the bailing of cotton and made the first meteorological observations in the Mississippi Valley in 1799. He even constructed an astronomical observatory in Union Hill near his Natchez home. His plantation, the forest, became a meeting place for scholars and naturalists. Daniel Clark, the U.S. Consul for New Orleans, recommended that Jefferson write to Dunbar regarding information about the land and inhabitants beyond the Mississippi River to the west. In 1804, then-President Jefferson asked Dunbar to assemble the first scientific expedition into the Lower Louisiana Purchase. Known as the Red River Expedition of 1804, Dunbar and his men brought back a wealth of scientific information, geological surveys, records of flora and fauna, and the first chemical analysis of the hot springs of Arkansas. My name is Rusty Jenkins, and William Dunbar was my great-great-great-great-grandfather, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.